Ingredients Technologies was split off from the cheese business, and this is an organisational point that's not unimportant, in order to force the team to bring value to whey and to drive innovation. It's transfer priced into that business, and their objective is to go out and work with customers, find solutions for them, drive value, and therefore smooth out the commodity price curves as we go as best we can. And therefore, science-led solutions have become critical to that and the development of two innovation centers as well as strong marketing input. Premix is vitamin and mineral blending, of which we are number three in the world after DSM and Fortitech, a US uh, multinational. And that has also driven a lot of learnings on fortification technology, the use of a wide range of micronutrients, And that has also supported the development of performance nutrition, which in the first step was an old-fashioned vertical integration. We bought a customer of the ingredient technologies business, but we would proudly say that because of the innovation we were bringing to customers, we lost no customer when we did that vertical integration, particularly in the US. And that's something we've we've been quite proud of. So that's the business model, and the point of putting this slide up is that we took a captive whey pool, split off a commercial entity and an innovation and R&D entity to drive value add there on a standalone basis, Uh, and then out of that we did a vertical integration into performance nutrition, and customised premix solution was an acquisition to bring in further capability in adding to the nutritional value of foods for our customers. And in that business as well, we also sell integrity. We take out complexity with 30 mi- up to 30 micronutrients in some mixes, but it must be precisely and absolutely correct. So I say to the people in that business, the one key thing we sell, apart from turnaround and, and, and response times, is integrity. Integrity of the performance of the mix and the content. Mm-hmm.